for the Haunters of Halloween. <laughs> this is Haunted School back again to do another guest review. And today's second review, I might try and do a couple today because uh, I missed out yesterday with getting this clock. And today it's going to be the Aldi Halloween Banjo Skeleton. This is the 2016 version and he's absolutely really good. I just got him today. And he's actually been improved from last year's, and I'll get onto that in a minute. But let's show you this packaging Halloween Magic, Halloween, Banjo Playing Skeleton, Bright and Easy, Perfect for Scaring Trick or Treaters, Ghoulish Fun for All Ages. It's not really a too scary prop boss, but he's still good, good, he's entertaining. I like this little worm in a witch hat, which looks pretty cool. Halloween Magic, yeah, it says it's all the same on the front. Yeah, it's just got some really nice artwork on this box. It's got like, obviously it's got a Frankenstein hand coming out of it, it looks really good. So yeah, it says Aldi logo and all that. To activate the product slide button, yeah, it's in position on. So that's, um, that's the box, so let me share this in closer detail. So here he is out of his box, um, he actually looks pr he's got the same um, skeleton as the DJ skeleton right here, but this one's a little smaller because he is sitting down on, on a little stand, the DJ is, but there's a comparison between the two, pretty similar, but yeah, I like the hat on this one though, because let's show you some nice close up detail, look at that, oh. Get some nice detail on his, um, um, I forgot what it's called, I don't know, <laughs> on his hat thing. He's got, he actually, if you've actually seen this in videos, and you've noticed why his waist is turning, it isn't because of his arm pulling what's got force in it, it's actually got an, a mechanism connected to its waist, because if you see here, it's got a little string right there, and th this little thing just pulls it, and it turns his waist, I actually thought that was really cool. It's just an extra thing what Asda's didn't have. Um, it's got um, pose, pose, lo, posable legs, not pose and stay, because mine don't really want to stay. Um, actually, when you pose it up there, it actually will stay on mine. Apparently, my mum says at my store, because she picked this up this morning, they had a couple of these. Um, they didn't have too many, like last year, they didn't have too many of them. So, I'm thinking this might be a popular one, maybe. It's got a speaker right there, a yellow trimy sticker, and yeah. I like the, I like the way this one looks more than the Asda one, because if you have a look at his face, yeah, I think it looks a lot better than Asda's, it looks a lot more realistic to a skeleton. It's made by Magic Power in 2010. It's a really cool, no nice little gravestone here, what he's sitting on. I actually thought it was really nice before I had him, when I first saw him on YouTube. So it says, rest in peace, born 8 1808, died 1858. So he only had like a 50 year life, that's, he, he died pretty young. <laughs> but, um, yeah, so without further ado, let me show you this in action. Oh, I forgot to tell you, the song is well better than last year's, because he plays the same song as the dueling banjo skeletons, Grandin Road ones. So here we go. <laughs> So that's him. He's actually really good. It's been so improved from that, from last year's banjo skeleton, and I, I thought it would play the same song as last year's. And guess what? He's actually got a different song. 
So I'm at, I'm going up Aldi later because I'm just going to take a look at props myself. We also picked up the um, Frankenstein door knocker and the pumpkin one, but me, they're my little brothers, so because he's out, I won't have to, I won't do a review of them. Well, now, but I might be getting the crow today because I got the Aldi catalogue with me. Well, not a catalogue; it's just like a weekly magazine. Um, let's look on the front. Um, let's try and find the page. So I might be getting the crow today. I'm taking off to take a look at these because they look cool. Um, because me and Horror haven't been chatting lately, and we've been talking about which props we should get. He agrees with me. He wants to pick up the banjo skeleton, the crow, and the I think the big twisty one. I'm not sure on that, but so that's out of ten, guys. I'll I'll rate this. I'll have to give him a 9.5 because I wanted this so much from Asda and his song's been improved um, I love this version of the song but better than the Asda one because uh, I like the dueling banjos skeletons they're just really good so that's about the end of the video guys please like it comment and subscribe and yeah as always keep haunting